Welcome to MathGPT. In today's lesson, we'll discuss an important topic in the field of medication dosages, the conversion between micrograms and milliliters. Many people get confused about these two units because they measure different things. Micrograms, or MCG, is a unit of mass, while milliliters, or ML, is a unit of volume. So, to convert between them, we need more information. As we know, mass and volume are related by density. Density tells us how much mass is contained in a unit volume, such as milligrams per milliliter. For example, if we have a solution that is one milligram per milliliter, that's a density factor. This allows us to calculate the volume of the solution needed to get a specific mass in micrograms. Let's do an example calculation. Let's say we have 250 micrograms of a medication, and we want to know what volume that corresponds to in ml. First, convert 250 micrograms to milligrams because our density is in mg slash ml. Remember, one milligram equals 1,000 micrograms, so we have 250 divided by 1,000, which gives us 0.25 milligrams. Now, use our density factor. At 0.25 milligrams, we need 0.25 milliliters, since our density factor is one milligram per milliliter. In conclusion, even though micrograms and milliliters measure different things, density allows us to relate mass to volume for specific substances and calculate conversions as we've seen here. Understanding these conversions is crucial, especially in medical and scientific fields where precise measurements and dosages are essential in everyday practice.